What is going on YouTube? I'm Valentino from NextGenSpeed.com I take out a project to show you guys for a 2016-2018 Camaro for the inside interior which are these pieces right here and they come in multiple colors such as blue, red, and yellow and stuff like that and these actually go on the doors around the speaker trim for those of you guys who are tired of your Camaro being all plain and Jane and like everybody else's with the regular black interior put these on your car and spice the interior and make it look nice and like I was saying, they're available in multiple colors. So check out nextgenspeed.com to check them out. And these come with double-sided tape for easy install. Just literally peel it off and stick it on. So I'm going to show you guys how it is, show you guys where to put it and how to put it on, and see how it looks and give you a little review. And even though I'm selling these on my website, I have a 2017 Camaro myself. So I want to give you a little review, show you guys how I feel about it myself, and just give you a full overview on how it is and how it looks. Got my 2017 Camaro SS over there. Clean as fuck, just cleaned her up. Open up your doors and take a look right by the speakers. You see a little outline from the factory that kind of outlines the speaker. And these literally just go right around there. Just like that. It's that easy. Just peel off the tape, stick it on, and that's pretty much it. Now to get these installed, get a microfiber towel and some water and a lighter too. You just want to take some water with the cloth, clean up the area a little bit. Make sure there's no grime or dirt on it. Just to give it a nice area for the adhesive to stick with no issues to make sure it doesn't fall off. We shouldn't have any worries with this falling off because it is pretty tight and holds pretty well. So now we got that cleaned up. Make sure you pick the right one for this side. Just make sure you line it up. Make sure it's all nice before you put it on. And once you're ready, peel off the adhesive by taking off a little bit of the corner. It's kind of hard to get to if you don't have any nails. As you can see, it just easy peels off like that. Make sure not to touch it with your fingers, not to get any dirt or grime on there, so it sticks nice and perfect. Now take your lighter. This is what you need the lighter for, just to heat up the adhesive a little bit to make it stick a lot better. Now you want to take your lighter, don't put it too close, just kind of skim it over and hover it. Just to give it some heat, but not directly with the flame. And then once you're ready, just want to line it up. You only got one chance at this, so try to get to it as perfect as you can. Get that down. Then just press it down, make sure it sticks nice and even. And there we go, it's all set. Got nice and installed. As you can see with the stock, with the standard one, it sticks pretty good. So over here it kind of flexes a little bit, but you can always fix that up. Then the next side, you just want to do the same exact thing. And as you can see, it's a pretty simple installation. About a two out of 10, not even. Kind of peeling and sticking and that's it. Makes the interior pop though, makes it look nice. Just something different than usual. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Check out nextgenspeed.com for more car parts and accessories for Camaros, Mustangs, and Dodge Chargers and Challengers, stuff like that. And in the comments below, let me know what you guys think about this product and all the products that I have on the website. Because right now we got about 100 products from Dodge Chargers to Challengers to Mustangs to Camaros to other cars. Please check that out if you haven't yet. And yeah, you can subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time.